Hey everybody, it's your favorite country boy, Numismatic Oki, or as Silverback Stacker says, Numismatic Oki. Not sure if that's some total autocorrect fail, or if uh, the man's got jokes. I think he's got jokes. I think he's got jokes too. <clears throat> but either way, hold on, let me get that. Let me stay out there. Okay, hopefully that's long enough that it'll pick that for, uh, yeah, we're long enough for them to pick it for, um, thumbnail. So this is a blind trade that Silverback and I did. I have no idea what he sent. He has no idea what I sent. We just matched like ounce for ounce and then type. So like I sent a specific number that were, um, milk spotted cause he's trying to do I think he said antiquing is what he does. He's trying to do with them. So we'll work on that. And uh <laughs> Okay. So he sent a card and then I had already messaged him and said I felt bad. I sent him an email because I forgot to include a note in the box because I was running late and in a hurry says uh hello there my friend i'm so glad we could make this trade i enjoy your channel a lot keep up the good work i hope you enjoy the goodies here in the kids were in school so i had to color this one myself <laughs> merry christmas and happy new year to you and yours your friend silverback stagger brother man that's pretty funny i like it i love you did a good let's see did he stay in the lines is that glitter He's and glitter that's glitter he stayed in the lines oh, wow. and used <laughs> glitter that's epic. Oh my god. <clears throat> That's, this right here, I'm framing this because this is the best part of the trade. It's already a good trade for me. I'm happy right there. Just right there. We don't even need to do the rest of the video. Oh, you better. I want to see what you got. <clears throat> so let's just pull it all out and see what oh, he's doing. Oh. Uh, uh, not quite. Thankfully, he didn't do as much bubble wrap as I did to DOC. <laughs> By the way, DOC, since you'll probably watch this, I did all that bubble wrap as revenge for everyone else that you did lots of bubble wrap to. <coughs> so let's see, we'll get the grandpa knife out. We'll start right here. Score that up a bit. Here we go. I can already see what it is, but I want to get it out. Check this thing out. Excuse me, Mrs. Yeah, she's... Getting over the floozy. Oh, that's really cool. Is that good? Yeah. Up there. Oh, I love it. I called dibs. One Troy ounce YPS. Um, Silverback, you're going to have to let me know, is YPS one of the pourers in the community that I just don't know about yet? Um, whoever the, whoever made this, that's, a, that's amazing. I called dibs. So the wife called dibs, which means this is hers now. <laughs> so let's do, let's do this one here. We are filming in the bedroom tonight. Not because I'm lazy, but because I'm still finishing the electric upgrade and all that stuff that I showed you guys earlier when I found that nice rotted out drywall underneath the old ceiling fan. So there's no, there's no light in there right now. So that's why we're filming in here. We have a one ounce silver 999 bullet. Looks like a 45 or a 44. It's probably a 45. Anyway, that's really epic. That's that's really cool. I like that. That one's mine. She can't have that one. No, I want Let's the cross. Jump over here to this little one. Ooh, it looks cool. Whatever it is, I can kind of see the shape, but... Alright, so let's show you right there. Stay. Ah, don't turn this way. You see my struggling. see my face. <coughs> and, and no one on the interwebs wants to see my ugly mug. There, there we go. I do love the sound of popping. Oh, it's a penguin. It's like a mandrake for Linux. Sorry, guys. I, I work in in IT, so. It's a little penguin. It's cute. Yeah, a little smile. Half an ounce. That's cool, man. I love it. I love this hand poured stuff, man. 
I'm really, really getting into it. Oh, oh, please let this be what I think it is. And even if it's not, this thing is really cool, but if it's what I think it is, it's gonna be awesome. <laughs> two troy ounce number 212 yps is what does it say jaeger's poured silver so i guess i know who yps is now jaeger's poured silver and look it's a lion head oh wow and it is one of the ones i thought it was i've seen a couple of these out there and i had talked about wanting to get one and that is some really cool relief your fingers are rough <laughs> So I'm a man. What do you want? I ain't no sissified city boy. Okay. That's... This one's probably my favorite so far. I don't know. I like the pink one. Oh, yeah. Well, you like cute stuff. Mm -hmm. I like the lion. <clears throat> it's really hard not to cut. Ooh, sorry. Oh. Ooh, three of them. Nice. Oh, cool. A prospector. Oh, different ones. Silvertown. That's cool. These are my first, like, production bars. My first bars are the ones I got from Z. Be careful how you turn it. Your face isn't. Uh, <laughs> Nobody wants to see that nonsense. Oh, a Geiger. Oh, my first Geiger. Let me block my f mug. Silverback, man, you outdid yourself. That is, that is awesome. My first Geiger bar. That is so cool. Oh, no way. Scottsdale. I was looking at these at the coin shop the other day, and I was thinking to myself I needed to get some. And I didn't do it because I made a promise to not buy anymore for the, for the year. Now I've got one. In God We Trust on it. Scottsdale Silver Bar. That is that is awesome. Did you say why we weren't buying uh, anymore? Um, I did mention why, but I don't like I don't like to talk about it because I feel like it's bragging. Mm. So but since people are gonna ask what are we talking about? Um we took the rest of the year off from pretty much right after Thanksgiving till the end of the year. Um we're still doing some of the bid board stuff, but as far as buying like i usually buy several ounces of silver a month and i haven't done that the rest of the year and the reason for that is every year for christmas and thanksgiving we adopt two different families or we do the angel tree for for some kids and uh we make sure that some other families have a good thanksgiving and a good christmas and I do that because I feel so blessed. I have a really good career. My wife has a good job, and she's she's in school to chase her dream career. And we have this beautiful farm and this amazing life that God gave us. And uh, I really just want to be able to give back and help other people who don't. So that's that's why I don't do it to be able to say I do it. Most of the time, the families that we help don't even know who we are. They never they never meet us. We don't meet them. And it's not that we wouldn't want to. It's just that. Uh, we don't do it for the for the recognition of it. We just do it to help and to give back. And it's so yeah, that's what we do. And this year our Christmas family was a single mom and three girls. Mm -hmm. And bought Christmas presents for all four of them. So And then uh, at church it was a single mom with the Oh that's right, and then there was baby a baby with um she was out of an abused. Yeah, there was a lady out out of the church that we helped. She, uh, yeah, she was, a, she's in one of those homes for women trying to get away from a bad situation. And we, we helped. I forgot about that one. At any rate, so that's why, that's why I haven't been buying silver in a holy crap. Ooh, that one's I already know it. This is the half ounce lunar. <clears throat> 2012 half ounce. Here, funny story, silverback. My coin guy has one that's not colorized sitting at his desk for me. Because, I, like I said, I'm not buying any more silver until the end of the year. But he's got one sitting there. It's not colorized. So I will have the two together. And that's amazing because this is my first colorized silver. And I'm sorry, i got to go off camera for a second. But 
Wow, that is incredible. Mm -hmm. You have see. to put them next to each other. Yeah, I'll, when I get the other one, I'll put them next to each other. Trying to get as close as I can. There, there we go. That is just amazing. And obviously, we know what the queen looks like. Hello! <laughs> <laughs> chip, chip, cheerio, and all that stuff. Oxy, right? Oxy, boy. Have some tea and crumpets. Anyways, that's a gorgeous coin. I wasn't expecting that. I really wasn't expecting any of this. This is the extras, but I didn't. I got caught up in what I was talking about, and I'm, I'm thinking these are the extras he sent. And I feel like my extras were nowhere near good enough. So, uh, Silverback, you might get a second package from me. Because, <laughs> wow. I mean, that half ounce alone is just incredible. What do we have here? Oh, the man knows I love the Second Amendment. It's a Moan Labe, which I can't be sure I'm pronouncing it correctly. Yeah, there you go. And it says, come and take it with the crossed ARs and a cannon. One ounce fine copper, and on the back, it's, it says Mon Labe twice in the original Greek with the Spartan helmet and the swords. I call dibs. No, you ain't getting <laughs> this. You out of your mind. This is all daddies. <clears throat> Silverback, man. This this is amazing. That's wow. That's a beautiful round. Okay, we have one more over here. I'm not sure what it is, but it's big. No way. That's a big coin. It's the two ounce, I think. The two ounce year of the snake. Two ounce silver year of the snake. I have the the same one, but I have the one ounce. So now I have a one and a two ounce. Silverback, you will be getting another package from me because cause mine, I did it blind and I wasn't sure what to do if, you know we both did blind trades so you will get another blind trade there's no way i'm going to tell you what i'm sending but i do know you're going to love it so you'll get to make a follow-up video um i will get those in the mail tomorrow i have another one to mail out so i'll mail both of them out tomorrow so you will get another package coming my friend because you way overdid me on the extras wow it's so far above what i was ever thinking so, yeah, you have another box coming, dude. No matter what you say, you have another box coming. I like that one. That's beautiful. The queen again. <clears throat> and she's a bigger one. Hello! <laughs> Why'd you have to give her a deeper voice? <laughs> yeah, because she's bigger. You know, she's bigger. She, her, her, this is Queen Atlas. She owns a security company. So okay. she's got a deep voice. <laughs> and drives a truck. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Anyways... Silverback, dude, this is this is incredible. Wow, that was my widest coin to date. Like the my other two ounces are the Queen's Beast, and they're thick. This is about the same thickness as a one ounce, but it's a it's so much bigger around. I like it. You can see all the detail. It's yeah, like... the detail is amazing. So I'm gonna steal camera back from Camera Girl. Oh, maybe you can send him a card this time. <laughs> yeah, we'll get you. We'll here get you a card. Here this is still. This is still the winner right here. That's still my favorite part. This right here made the trade worth it. Like that, I was already winning at that point. You just have to color it. You have to color it on your own. Oh God, I can't stand the lines. So we got the roaring lion, the cute little cuddly penguin, the bullet, the beautiful cross, and then. That colored dragon, the three. Now, yeah, this is actually the wrong way. Let's, oh no, it's right. It says that way. Okay, I thought I had it backwards. The Geiger, that Silvertown Prospector, and the Scottsdale. And then that Moan Labe. Here, we'll flip that. That's actually the, the badass side right there. Look at the detail on that coin. And then, just an absolutely incredible coin right there. Silverback Brother, you, you, yeah, that was amazing. Uh, everyone else, please like, subscribe, and uh, see you all next time down on the farm. I got some coins to pick out for Silverback.